Okay, I'm Rory Hughes from Gonzaga College from Dublin and my project is a cycle helmet with built-in sensor control indicators. So it has di different motion sensors in it. So when you're coming up to a turn and you tilt your head, it turns on the indicator and when you go around the corner it automatically switches it off. It also has a brake light in it so when you slow down the brake light turns on. Well my friend gave me the idea of using indicators on a bike by pressing buttons on the bike and feeding wires up your back but I came up with the idea instead of making it all inside of a helmet because you don't have to take your hands off the bike so if you're on a main road it's quite dangerous to take your any hands off the bike because you might fall. I cycle school every day and I kind of noticed that if you put up your hand the cars might not see you straight away but if it's a flashing light like the traditional way on cars they'll always see you. I have used it out on the bed on the roads. Here's a video of me with, with the stopping there and the brake light comes on. All the programming and research to detect how I can do it all within the helmet took a few, like a month or two but the building only took about five days. So this is like the brain of it, it's called a microcontroller which I've linked up to the computer so when I write a program, a smart program on the computer, it loads it into this. There's a small board in there which is the motion sensor. This is the brake light board here and there are two indicators which are diffused by ping pong balls to get the light out more. There's two batteries here and they link up to this port here, which put them together to make enough power. Well, I really, I'm probably going to patent the idea, so um, no one can take it, and I'm, I might make a few of them, I don't know yet.